Do you find it difficult to recognize the face of an individual? Or while watching television, the images look blurred? Have you noticed that straight lines of the tiles are appearing wavy? All these can be the common symptoms of an aging eye, known as age-related macular degeneration. The macula is an area at the back of your eye that you use for seeing fine details such as reading a book or recognizing a face. Macular degeneration happens when the macula at the back of the eye is damaged. Age-related macular degeneration, AMD or ARMD, is the most common cause of vision loss in those aged over 50. In India, the prevalence ranges from 1.8% to 4.7%. Age-related macular degeneration or ARMD accounts for 8.7% of the total blindness globally and is the third common cause of visual impairment. ARMD is the most common form of macular degeneration and develops in older people. As the name suggests, it becomes more common with increasing age. If you develop ARMD in one eye, you have a high chance of developing it in the other eye too. About twice as many women over the age of 75 have ARMD compared with men of the same age. Certain risk factors increase the risk of developing ARMD. They are Smoking tobacco High blood pressure A family history of ARMD Ultraviolet rays High levels of dietary fat intake There are two types of age-related macular degeneration, dry ARMD and wet ARMD. Dry ARMD is the most common form and occurs in 9 out of 10 cases. In this type, the macula gradually becomes thin and degenerates. Typically, dry ARMD is a very gradual process as the number of affected cells increases. It usually takes several years for vision to become seriously affected. Many people with dry ARMD do not totally lose their reading vision. Wet ARMD occurs in about 1 in 10 cases. However, it is likely to cause severe visual loss over quite a short time, sometimes just months. Very occasionally, if there is a bleeding from a new blood vessel, this visual loss can occur suddenly, within hours or days. Macular degeneration is the result of damage to the nerve cells in the macula. The macula is the part of the retina that is most densely packed with two types of cells, rods and cones. The macula is essential for central vision. In people with ARMD, the rods and cones do not get adequate nutrition and do not clear waste materials. As a result, tiny abnormal deposits called drusen develop under the retina. Gradually, rods and cones degenerate, stop working and finally die. This is the dry type of ARMD. The wet form happens when abnormal new blood vessels grow under the macula. These blood vessels break easily and leak blood and fluid under the macula. This can damage the rods and cones and cause scarring in the macula, which can distort your central vision. How do I know I am suffering from ARMD? The main early symptom is blurring of central vision despite using your usual glasses. 
peripheral vision is not affected with ARMD and so it does not cause total blindness. In the early stages of the condition, you may notice that you need brighter light to read, words in a book or newspaper may become blurred, colors appear less bright, you have difficulty recognizing faces, straight lines appear wavy or crooked. A blind spot then develops in the middle of your visual field. This tends to become larger over time as more and more rods and cones degenerate in the macula. ARMD is painless. Symptoms of dry ARMD tend to take 5 to 10 years to become severe. However, severe visual loss due to wet ARMD can develop more quickly. If the vision of only one eye is affected, you may not notice any symptoms, as the other good eye often compensates. You are more likely to notice symptoms when both the eyes are affected. Older people should have regular eye checks to check each eye separately for early ARMD. If you develop symptoms suggestive of ARMD, your doctor will refer you to an ophthalmologist who is specialized in managing eye disorders. The ophthalmologist may ask you to look at a special piece of paper with horizontal and vertical lines known as Amsler grid to check your visual fields. If you find that any section of the line is missing or distorted, then ARMD is a possible cause of the visual problem. The ophthalmologist will examine the back of your eye with a special microscope called slit lamp to look for the typical changes that occur with dry ARMD and wet ARMD. Another special test uses special light rays to scan the retina, which can give very detailed 3D information about the macula and can show if the macula is thickened or abnormal. This test is useful when there is doubt about whether ARMD is the wet or dry form. At times, your doctor may inject a dye into a vein in your arm. Then, by looking into your eyes with a magnifier and taking pictures with a special camera, he can visualize any eyes in the macula But treatment can delay in progression or even improve vision. Degeneration depends on whether the disease is in its early stage, dry form, or in the more advanced wet form that can lead to serious vision loss. For the less common wet ARMD, treatment may halt or delay the progression of visual loss in some people. Wet ARMD can often be treated if it is caught early enough. And this is normally done by injecting a drug into the fluid inside your eye. This shrinks the new blood vessels that are leaking and putting pressure on the macula. You may need to have this repeated every few weeks for a few months. In another technique called as laser photocoagulation, a fine laser is fired at the tiny new blood vessels that are forming. This destroys the developing new blood vessels which helps to prevent the condition from getting worse. People undergoing this treatment will develop a permanent black or grey patch affecting their vision and no sight is restored. Certain groups of patients with ARMD both wet and dry types, can benefit from vitamin and mineral supplements. 
these supplements can slow down the progression of ARMD. A specific combination of vitamins and minerals has been tested and found to be most effective. The mixture includes vitamin C, vitamin E, lutein, zeaxanthin, beta carotene, zinc, and cupric oxide. Two large five year clinical trials, the Age Related Eye Disease Study or AREDS 2001, and a follow up study called AREDS 2 2013, have shown nutritional supplements containing antioxidant vitamins, lutein, and zeaxanthine can reduce the risk of dry ARMD progressing to sight threatening wet ARMD. Certain vitamins are linked with specific diseases. For example, omega-3 fatty acids have been shown to be associated with increased risk of prostate cancer. Because of these potential problems, you should talk to your ophthalmologist before starting these supplements. Currently, the best way to protect your eyes from developing early macular degeneration is to eat a healthy diet. Exercise and wear sunglasses that protect your eyes from the sun's harmful UV rays. If you smoke, try to stop, as smoking is a risk factor for many illnesses, including ARMD. Eat a healthy, balanced diet and ensure to get plenty of the various types of vitamins that may help in ARMD. Consider regular sight tests as you get older. You should visit an ophthalmologist every two years, even if there is no change in your vision. An eye test can often pick up the first sign of ARMD even before you notice any change in your vision. 